Welcome Capricorns. I'm happy to be back with you guys. What's up? What's up? What's up? So I hope you guys have been doing well, you know, with all of this crazy talk going on in the world right now. I hope you guys are doing well, okay? Um, I do want to let you guys know that currently I am running a special for my readings. My readings are originally $67. They are currently on sale for $40. Four dollars and forty-four cents. Okay. If you would like to book your very own personal reading with the Empress, that information is going to be in that drop box below. All right. And as well, guys, there's absolutely nothing that I can do about the ticking noise in the background coming from the detector. Um, maintenance has to come completely change it out and get a new one, a bed, a fresh battery, and all of that isn't going to work. Um, they're going to have to actually put a new one in. They aren't coming into anyone's homes right now, okay, due to what's going on, okay? So, if you don't like the ticking noise, y'all can find somebody else to listen to, okay? With my readings, guys, if you want to book your very own personal reading, it does come with an additional question, okay? The additional question is going to be for free, all right? So, you get your, you get to ask your personal question, then you get to get a personal, another personal question answered for free the only catch is with the second question it has to be a yes or a no question okay because i am going to utilize the pendulum to get your answer okay so with that being said if you're new to my channel welcome 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 don't forget to click the bell on your way in all right hit that like button give me show me some love show me some love hit the like button and don't forget to share with your family and your friends, okay? So let's get into it, okay? This is going to be for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, okay? So let's see what energy is coming towards Capricorns, okay? My Capricorns. What's going on in the goat world? Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, please. What messages is there for my Capricorns, please? Capricorns. Sun, moon, and rising. Venus, please. Capricorns. What message is there for Capricorns? All right. All right, let's do it. What? Capricorns, like y'all was just so <laughs> okay. I'm getting very, 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 very okay. Let's start off from the from the bottom of the deck, okay. Oh okay. I'm getting Someone's, um, stop fighting here. Okay, someone stop putting in the effort. Some of you are dealing with a water sign. I got Pisces here twice. Got Queen of Cups and the Moon card here. Pisces, Cancer, Energy. Three of Swords, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But I'm getting like an apology, okay? Like someone's trying to apologize or try to apologize. Um, something here is starting to get on your nerves. I'm just getting like this energy has been for, for my past two readings, okay? Let me get some sage. So something here is annoying you. You feel like very annoyed, okay? I feel like there's an apology that wants to be given or because we got the three of swords here. We got the three of swords here and the... Eight of Wands. 
It's definitely an apology. Eight of Pentacles. Someone tried to apologize to someone. Because um, I got the King of Cups here. He's in the reverse. It's not good for the King of Cups to be in the reverse. Okay, this is someone that uses their emotions to maybe manipulate. Um, to, like, he's a real asshole when he's in the reverse, okay? But somebody, I'm getting, like, tried to apologize for somebody's being an ass. I'm also getting very stubborn, hard-headed energy here for future energy. There could be some things that are being hidden here. Okay, that are kept in the dark. But let's see. Why is the page of pentacles here in the reverse? I'm getting like someone's asking for a ride. Or that was just literally like how, how it just came out to me. Like it was like ask for a ride. Um why is the chariot here? Some of you guys are dealing with the cancer. Okay. Someone's leaving. Okay. Someone's leaving a party or something that had a lot of people. Okay. That was surrounding a lot of people. I don't know where I'm getting here. And there's still this, this apology talk. Okay. With well, the three of swords and the eight of wands and the page of wands. Okay. Why is the moon here in the reverse? Why is the moon here in the reverse? Somebody wants a second chance here. Somebody wants a second chance. Yep. Possibly with a Leo. But I'm getting like somebody just had some type of wake up call. Okay. And once again, here we are again at the bottom of the deck. Somebody is worried or anxious to say sorry. Um, someone's asking for forgiveness here is what I'm getting. Like somebody wants forgiveness. Somebody wants a second chance. Nine of Cups and the Judgment card and the Sun card. Somebody woke up, is waking up to something here. I'm getting the moon card in reverse and the sun card here. Something could have been hidden and is now coming to the light. Okay. Why is the sun card here? Gosh, you guys, cards are flying everywhere. Yeah, like temperance. You guys want to reconcile or balance something out. Is there someone, some, I'm getting like somebody needs to apologize to somebody. Ten of Pentacles in the reverse, Star in the reverse, Tower, ju Justice, Four of Wands. There's a marriage here. There could be a Libra involved. I'm getting there could be family. Like this could be family oriented or something. For some of you, this could be someone dealing with their family. Uh, something, something fell apart here, and I feel like you lost hope. But I feel like. Right now, someone wants a second chance at something here. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius. Five of Pentacles. Someone feels left out. And something, the truth, the whole truth is not out yet. Okay. Look, yes. The whole truth is not out. Things are not 100% clear. Maybe you haven't been making things 100% clear. Okay. The Emperor in the reverse. Aries is energy, but someone here is being stubborn, hard-headed as hell. Why is the Emperor here in the reverse? This is the Father card as well. You can be dealing or conversating or having a conversation with an older person here. Why is the Emperor here? Or there's an older person that steps in. Mmm. Yeah, so ooh. I'm getting that there is some people that is jealous. Could be someone in a circle, okay? Someone that could be older than you. You may feel like this person is jealous. And maybe you've been listening to this person or getting advice from this person. 
But now you're starting to see that this person may just be a little jealous. Five of Swords and a Three of Cups. Huh. I'm getting someone as a player, too. Somebody is a big time player. Mm, there's lots of like competition. I'm getting like there's a lot of competition here. Like you're at in a um a war with someone, like to see who's the best on something here. There's definitely some competition between peers. There may be some drinking going on, some celebrating. And then, like, there's, like, someone being cautious to make sure that, you know, nothing pops off. Because I'm getting, like, some real hostile energy. Like, a conflict of some sort. Trying to avoid a conflict. Maybe when there's alcohol around with that Three of Cups, you know, people are... They got their cups up. They're drinking. You know, they're celebrating. They're having fun. But somebody is so power struck. Somebody is so uh, stubborn. And they're not listening to something. Why is the five of wands here? Someone's very competitive. Yeah, look at this. Four of wands. There could this could be involving like family or a community. Okay, someone's going back and forth. Okay, someone might have get invited to someone's home. Maybe you're being invited to someone's home or a group or a center or some type of event. I'm getting like there's like an, an invitation to some type of event because there's like partying, drinking, friends around. Like I'm getting that type of energy and someone being invited to some type of get together. Okay, so give me some more messages for Capricorn, please. What other messages are there for Capricorns? Someone, someone here could be having regrets about something here. It could be about something material. Or they missed the opportunity. Yeah, somebody missed the opportunity. You may be feeling like you missed the opportunity with someone or a, a situation. You may feel like you missed the opportunity, okay? And you're kind of pissed about it. Why is justice here? Okay. So there's a battle here. That needed to be balanced out. Some of you are dealing with a Libra. But I'm getting like there's some issue. Some, some type of issue that you're trying to balance out. Some of you guys have been distancing yourself too. Some of you have been taking time off, okay, like you're on a break period. But I feel like some of you guys are waiting for some type of truth to be revealed as well. Like, that keeps coming out. Yeah, Ace of Cups in the reverse. Some of you have been holding back your emotions. You've been waiting to explain or waiting to tell, speak this truth. Yeah, you've been keeping it to yourself. Somebody's waiting till someone gets in a relationship. Or what is this? Why is this? You're waiting for you to find your soulmate. Okay, you're waiting on your soulmate. But there's some unfinished business here. I feel like you haven't closed, completely closed out a chapter here. With the world reverse. You want something, but you may not be sure if it's going to work as well. 
There's some things that I kept in the dark that you're keeping a secret. Okay, I feel like you're keeping some type of secrets here. But you sure ready to party. You ready to party. Look, look at this. Six of Wands, you're getting attention. Yeah, like you ready to turn up. You ready to turn up? I see that. <laughs> so y'all ain't letting nothing stop y'all. Period. <laughs> All right, so let's see. What message do we have for the Capricorns for the month of April? What message do you have for Capricorn for the month of April? All right. So we got deep replenishment. Some For some of you, it's time to take a break. I feel like a lot of you guys may have... You know, be getting ready to come off of a break, or some of y'all are getting ready to go on a break period. Um, and spirit also wants you to know that you don't have to dim your light to fit in. How are you dimming your light in order to fit in? You don't have to dim yourself to be around a certain group of people or act a certain way. You don't have to dim your light to fit in. Okay. Some of you guys need to align your life. What is not aligned or needs to be changed? So maybe some of you guys need to make some adjustments or some type of changes. Well, I feel like a lot of you guys may have when you were in a meditative state, when you were taking your break. I feel like a lot of you guys were getting energetic upgrades, okay? And you've been going through some type of awakening. And I did realize that when you guys had the judgment card and the sun card. Definitely an awakening moment, okay? So some of you guys have gone through some, like, healing process um, where you isolated yourself. And then, you know, you came out of hermit mode because you were, you're, while you were in hermit mode, you were very much so thinking and revising and looking over things, okay? And it's like, now you're coming out of that, and now you're, like, ready to party, you're ready to turn up, you're ready to enjoy the festivities, okay? So let's see what messages the angels have for you. What messages are there for my Cappies? What messages are there for Cappies? We got Perfect Timing. All right. And we got Unlikely. Well, this one to flip over. What is that? We got Reconsider. Let me get one more card, please, for Capricorn. We got Helpful People. Meditation brings answers, okay? Something here, Spirit wants you to wait on, okay? There's something here that needs, that you are trying to recover from, okay? So, I feel like there's something that you guys need to be patient on, okay? I feel like if you believe, okay, we got if you believe, spirit is going to let you know when it's time to take action. But I feel like right now, spirit is saying, wait. I feel like some of you guys want to apologize to somebody because I, for some reason, I kept getting it, like... You want to apologize to someone, right? Let's see what perfect timing is. See, look, judgment card pop right out, okay? This is an awakening, okay? This is a second chance, giving a second, cha a second chance at something, okay? Perfect timing. This is the universe conspiring in your favor. Why is judgment? It's time to make a final decision as well. Why is judgment here? Yeah, Knight of Pentacles, you guys' energy. I feel like you guys are going through some type of awakening, okay? Something about your past. It's something about, someone here is thinking about the good old days. With the Nine of Swords and the Six of Cups and the Sun card, somebody is definitely thinking about the good old days. Okay, so we have Unlikely. Why is Unlikely, why is unlikely here? Oh, someone is unlikely to get the full story here. Really? Someone's doing some spying on someone. I see that as well. Someone is looking to see if someone is doing good without them. You got the Nine of Pentacles, the Empress. Okay. Someone's checking to see if someone's doing good. Okay. How their finance is looking. How they look on them pictures. I'm seeing that there's a little bit of spying going on. Somebody's spying on somebody's page. Okay. 
Oh, because someone hasn't communicated. You haven't been in communication with this person. So are you the one watching or are they watching? Somebody's watching. So maybe you feel like you're not getting all the tea that you need by just looking, by just watching on the page. Okay, why is we consider here? The world in reverse. Okay, so there's unfinished business. There's unfinished business here. Why is the world in reverse? Why is the world in reverse? Yeah, the two of wands in reverse, okay. So, you may feel like, some of you may be plotting, okay. Maybe this is someone that's at a distance from you with this world card. Maybe you feel distant from this person. You want to make some type of plans. I got the magician. Yeah, you want to make some changes. Look at this, okay. We got the magician and the will of fortune. I feel like you want to make some type of change. You feel like you need to make some type of changes, okay. Maybe you're planning or plotting. Maybe, that, like I said, this person could be at a distance from you. Maybe you're planning some type of trip or something to that nature. But... There's some competition here that I'm getting. Like, it's between a few different people. We have the Queen of Cups and the Queen of Swords and the Five of Wands. So there's a battle of some sort or competition possibly between a water sign and an air sign. But there's just like, maybe you need to reconsider making, making some type of changes to something. Why is the Five of Wands here? There's something here about jealousy and some, it's just something here like someone's battling something um, that's non-traditional, that wasn't done the right way. Okay, there's a battle. Okay, I'm getting like someone's coming between something as well. Let's see why helpful people is here. Oh, four cups. So, hmm, you might feel like you don't need no help. King of Pentacles, your energy. And this is where this stubborn energy is coming from. Look at this. Emperor in the reverse. Oh. Yeah, you don't, you feel like I don't need no help from anybody. Oh, okay. Some of you feel like I got a job. I'm doing good. We got the Eight of Pentacles and the Three of Pentacles. Baby, that's somebody that's working. That's building. You could be building your own business. You could just be steadily getting work, you know, steady at work. Um, but you're, you know, you don't feel like you need no help. And that's where the stubborn energy is coming from, okay? So, a lot of you guys feel like you don't want, you don't need anybody to help you. You don't need their help. You'll get it out of the mud. You're going to get it done. You're going to make it happen. All right, so I hope this message was helpful for my cappies. All right. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. If you want to book your very own personal reading, that information will be in the drop box below as well. All right. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up, guys. Until next time.